breaks my heart. He makes me feel so guilty like I'm abusing him or abandoning him. It's like I was your special boy. It was all about me. Now it's all about me, me. Mia. We're talking about the sad man over there. Oh, he walked away. The moment of truth. Yep. Here, Colt. Come here. We're going to try this. It's bit on. It'll be interesting to adjust it. I'm not quite sure. I couldn't find like Whoa. a fitting instructions anywhere. Uh huh. She's checking out Colt. Colt. Oh, y'all color coordinated today. We are. That looks good on you, Mia. It's the Lemieux Loire. Looks good. So this is a Happy Mouth mouthpiece with a center little roller. So it's supposedly a soft mouthpiece. But it has more of a structured hackamore to it Oops. than our miler. I'm just gonna try to get a close up here. At the same time, keep the dog away from her heads. Come here, Colt. We're all in the shadow. I don't know if this is gonna turn out. Okay, we'll get a better picture in the sun. She doesn't seem to mind it. Looks like she's ready to take a nap. Yeah, well they say when horses like the mouthpiece that's in their mouth, they're really quiet and they don't really fuss it's when standing and bridling. But when they don't like it, they're like fussing and biting at it and stuff. So she seems quiet. And then um, I put this halter fleece on just so it's a little bit softer or else it's just I think it's like a metal chain type deal covered in thick rubber but then um, a lot of people suggested putting this nose band on so it's really squishy so it's not comfortable or uncomfortable mm -hmm. it makes it much more comfortable and then this is just a plain leather strap the back but we just need to make sure it's not too much for her <laughs> she keeps wanting to see the camera yeah. <laughs> so this is just the leather strap that it came with and that's what we're gonna try but that looks good. Looks to be about the right. It would show up so much better in the sun, but it's we're in shade and it's really hot today, so we're standing in the shade. She is falling asleep. Look at her. Yeah, she doesn't seem to mind it. Okay. Yeah. Apologize, I'm filming while I'm holding a dachshund in my lap who's whining because he wants to go run around. He's making me jerk the camera everywhere. Colt's in it. You make it difficult to film Colt. No. No. I'm losing her. I'm frame. Colton, you gotta be a good boy. If you wanna come, you have to be a good boy. Pups, you are so impatient. We'll go run around and play. We will go run around and play when the lesson's over. You need to behave. Come on, behave.
So it's going to be a check with the rain. It's not going to be, you know, you can't hold on to that sucker. And the steering is going to be way different. Yes. Yeah, check her if you need to, and you can hand check her with this bit. Keep your shoulders up. That's why I guess on that one video at Galway, she's like, not a hackamore. Okay, let her walk for a sec. Oh, okay, that works too. Let's see what she's like this way. Come yes, you're not done. And she hasn't been... She's not even close to full speed. Acting up. Well, it seems like it works. Yeah. She's not as... Not as affected by it. No. No, she's not either trying to run through it or grab it and, and uh, hang on. I think she was confused at first. Probably. But you've got to get your body up a little more when you check her. Yeah. Which you're going to have to do in front of the jumps. You're going to have to bring the body back, sit, and check. Did he get a drink? Yeah. I built her a roll of mouthpiece. <laughs> Girl. Good girl. And no, you don't get to do that yet either. Good girl. Don't get too short on the reins. Good. One more over that and then take her through the grid. Don't work it on the steering. You gotta lose a lot more outside leg for the turn, I think. Good girl. So she needs to be together to do this grid, but right underneath her. She cannot be strung out, she cannot flatten. Good. Pull. Good. She has to hold. I felt my left leg come off. Gee. So I want to see a better elbow release. Take over those fences. Good. 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 Use your body. Use your abs.
Mia, are you digging your Gatorade? She's only drinking about half a bucket. Usually she kills it. Although the flies are biting her. Oh, you mean so you're going to finish? Are you going to let mommy drink it? Gonna polish off the Gatorade. Gulping it down. I wonder how many electrolytes are really in this and how much of it's got sugar. But it is water. I'm getting in the drinks. It's like you drink in your Slurpee. The Slurpees don't have electrolytes. I know. Gatorade has some, but I don't know how much. We're gonna experiment putting electrolytes in the Gatorade water. Because I have a feeling Gatorade's mostly sugar. So this is like one scoop of electrolytes. That's kind of a lot. Maybe half that. Might be too salty in addition to the saltiness the Gatorade already is. Um, we're a little tangled. Oh, well, my tucker is so messy right now. I know. Usually it's much neater than this. Well, I still haven't been able to put everything away from the show last week. In the dust. Uh, what a waster. Me? That's probably like a dollar. So you're thinking about getting the, you said Mary's Botanicals makes bit butter? Something like that, yeah. It's in it a stick? Huh? Is it a stick? Like a push-up stick or something? Yeah, it looks like a large chopstick if I remember right. Okay. But um, her, her lips pucker out, like they come out, and that's what makes getting bits hard. You can't really tell, but she has a small face, but huge lips, like this, come straight out. Okay. So a lot of bits tend to poke her, especially if they're loose rings. Or hers, even though it's not a loose ring, it has a part that uh, like moves up. So that's why the bit comes with bit guards on it. But even still, I don't want her lips to get pinched underneath the bit guard. So I might put in some bit butter type stuff just to prevent it. But it doesn't look like she got rubbed at all. Like I was wondering about. Now I gotta do that. I like it. It's. I haven't shown it yet from right here. So this is what it looks like. It's the happy. I need to get in the sun. It's the happy mouth bit. So it comes, I think it's metal chain type under here, and then it comes with this thick rubber covering, but that's still a little bit harsh. So I put a Fleeceworks nose band cover, and it's really cushy. Is that a, did I just make up a word? No? Cushiony? And then here's up. the side, so the cheek piece attaches here. I couldn't find anywhere of how to fit these bridles. Most companies have a guide of how to know that they fit right, so we were kind of just guessing. This is the leather strap that it comes with, and we found that the leather is perfectly enough. She doesn't need to chain or anything with this. Um, it does have a long shank, so it does give a lot of leverage, which we weren't too sure if it was too much for her. So I just rode her with one rein, and we treated it like a hackamore, and she was fine. And the mouthpiece piece, mouth piece is the hackamore, or not hackamore, happy mouth rubber. No, it's plastic. Colt, just try to jump in your lap and I know, I know. Um, so it's apple scented. It isn't a French link, it's a rolling link. So this rolls and then it has bit guards that comes on it. So the mouthpiece was really soft and gentle, which she liked. So when she would get a little bit quick and I'd ask her to half halt, and when she ran into the bit, if that makes sense, like she like ran into it, she backed off without flipping her mouth or flinging her mouth, which is what happens if something's like too much for her. So she respectful, respectfully came back pretty easy and soft. Um, and I had plenty of breaks. We even galloped. Oh, dog just jumped amount. in my lap. <laughs> uh, we galloped a decent speed and she still came back to me pretty easy. Um, so I like it. Tomorrow we're going to test it out off property and we're going to mimic a cross country course. 
so we'll see. So far, so good. But um, it looks like a lot, but it actually rode a lot softer than I expected. So um, yeah, and they have a bu bunch of different mouthpieces. I just chose one that'd be soft. And apparently horses aren't as easily able to lean on a bit that has a little rolling piece. So, yep, that's it. Guess he wants to walk around instead of play in the water. Yeah, he doesn't want to play. 